There was once a boy named Percy. He made a time machine. He, he made it to use for good, not evil. But one day it was stolen without a trace, and he couldn't find out what happened to it. Some time later, he was taking a trip on the boat, the USS Grizzly, which had a captain who was a bear. Another boat, the Getty Creamer, accidentally crashed into them and the boat sank. I'm a shark. I'm going to go eat you all. <laughs> Percy escaped from the boats and swam to the nearest island. Little did he know it was no ordinary island. He looked around the island, but it was deserted. He gathered coconuts to eat and to make a giant SOS sign. For two days, nothing happened. But the third night, a blue moon rose. And the island began to shake. Also, a mechanism pushed a chest to the surface of the sand, which Percy tripped on. He opened it to find a unique key and brought it with him. Elsewhere on the island, an ice cream man from the past suddenly fell from the sky. <laughs> suddenly, dinosaurs attacked. <laughs> ice cream at the dinosaurs and dragons, but they ate him. Back on the beach, Percy saw a huge spaceship that had crashed. It was a planned express ship, and there was someone inside, a delivery boy named Philip J. Fry. Percy helped him get out of the crashed ship, and Fry managed to help him decipher what the key was for. Fry, w Fry was from the future, and he had seen dinosaurs and, and dragons on the island. Somewhere on the island, there was a time machine bringing things to the present from the past and the future. They had to turn it off, but where was it? Percy accidentally dropped the key on the sand. When he picked it up again, he discovered it, it had left a print in the sand. It was a map. Percy and Fry followed the directions on the map to find the time machine, but when they got there, they discovered a dangerous robocroc was guarding it. It saw them and attacked. They dodged the robocroc and got to the time machine, but just as the robocroc was about to chop them up, they put in the key and turned it. Suddenly, all the dinosaurs, dragons, and the robocroc were sent back to the time they came from. Hooray! A panel in the side of the time machine opened and they saw self-destruct counting down. Five, four, three, they ran and just barely got out in time before the machine exploded in a giant fireball. <laughs> Percy and Fry fixed the Planet Express ship and Fry took Percy home from the deserted island. They had become good friends, but Fry needed to go back to the future, so they said goodbye. The end. <laughs>